Tragedy in South Louisville. We've been reporting since 5 o'clock tonight. The latest on the breaking news there, a fatal fire in the Auburndale neighborhood right near Iroquois Park. We've learned one person is dead and one child rushed to the hospital in downtown Louisville. Tom Lally is still on the scene right now. And Tom, what are Louisville firefighters telling you about their investigation? Yeah, they're telling me that the fire started in the back of the house, but the biggest thing that we've learned so far is like you just mentioned, Doug, that one person is dead tonight and a child was rushed to the hospital. The adult who was found dead was near the rear of the house, and that's where Major Bobby Cooper believes this fire started. I'm going to get out of the way so that our photojournalist Ian Hardwit can give you a clearer picture. You know, if you stand in the right spot, you can see clear through this home. The fire rose through the roof and knocked out the windows. Neighbors came and saw the fire fully engulfing the home. They described it to me as the worst fire they've seen, hot and spreading quickly. Now, a lot of neighbors did try to help. That's something that Major Bobby Cooper was happy to tell us. Uh, take a listen. Neighbors were on scene trying to do what they could do, giving us as much information as they can. But again, we arrived on scene in three minutes, but by the time we arrived on scene, fire had already progressed pretty rapidly. And now this is just off of New Cut Road. We're just south of Iroquois Park and police are still here on scene. They've blocked off the roadways on both sides. So if this is part of your evening commute, you're going to want to make sure you avoid it. Also, that wind is just starting to come in and you can still smell the smoke in the air. Uh, we also want to let you know that Major Bobby Cooper stressed one thing is going to be crucial as they continue their arson investigation tonight, determining if the smoke detectors were working. Now, they don't know the answer to that just yet, but they also stressed anyone can call 311 and they can have firefighters come out to your home, check your smoke detector, do an inspection, and even in small, install a smoke detector if you don't have one. In the meantime, we're going to be hoping for a good outcome for that child and looking to learn more about how they're doing and any updates that we can provide. We'll share here and on the night team tonight at 11. Live in Louisville, Tom Lally, WHAS 11, on your side.